So today, what I got, I thought this was gonna be easy, making all these. I got a bunch of big uh, mashed potatoes, a big pan of mashed potatoes here. So if you can see, I got the light off and I'll explain why in a minute. Um, yeah, so I thought this was gonna be easy to make all these mashed potatoes. It wasn't, it took me forever. But anyways, I got them. And the reason why I got the light off is because I finally got a scale that would be able to weigh all this out. And what I'm gonna do is I'll come around and I'll, sh I'll move the camera so you can see the scale. I'll tear out the scale and we'll put this on and see what it weighs. And then we'll know exactly how much I'm eating instead of trying to guesstimate and weighting it up all different. All right, so I'll come around and move that camera. All right, so hopefully we can read the numbers. I got the light off so you can read the numbers. I'll turn it back on. So I'm gonna tear out the scale. I'm gonna put this bowl on just because the pan covers up everything. And then this pan will be the weight of that aluminum pan. So we'll tear that out. So that reads zero. Yeah, you can see it. So I'll take this away and we'll put the potatoes on. And we'll see how much these potatoes actually weigh. You guys are, so 14, can you see that? Yeah, 14 point, almost 14, five ounces. So not quite 14 and a half. I do have some gravy. Excuse me while I go through the, I'm gonna dump some gravy on there. We'll see what this goes up to. Oh God, this gravy looks hot. All right. Uh, so what does it say? 18.7, so 18, close to 18 and a half pounds. Crap. Okay, so I'm gonna move this back. You guys can actually see what this weighs. Oh, I don't know why I do this to myself. One of these days, I'm just gonna do an easy challenge. Let me move the camera back so you can move up and see everything. I think that'll be good. And we'll down a little bit more. All right, so turn the light on. And all right, so. Oh. I'm gonna sit down for this. This is gonna take a while. Oh my God. So yeah, 18 and a half verified pounds of potatoes. Oh, I could have made more. <laughs> I thought it was, I saw the pan filling up. I was like, there's no way. So, oh, all right. So the potatoes are kind of cooled off. I hope the gravy is still pretty hot. You can see the steam. Hopefully it's not gonna be too hot. Yeah, I'm just gonna do my best here. We'll see, we'll see how this goes. Been in the off season, no contest. Well, actually, there's a contest today, shrimp cocktail. I'm not going, I don't really like shrimp cocktail. The prize structure is not great. So it wasn't really worth me going. I went last year. I guess the shrimp was really good, but I just don't like shrimp cocktail and it tasted not good to me. So anyways, let's, I don't know if this is in the way. Okay, so I'll start the timer. You can see the timer started. Drop my phone in the potatoes. And yeah, let's see. Oh. It's hot. Ooh. I let these potatoes sit for quite a while too. The potatoes are not that hot though. Gravy's freaking wicked hot. Kind of made a mistake with the gravy. I used sausage gravy. I didn't realize it was white. I don't know anything about cooking. Brown gravy would have gave a better color contrast.
So to make these potatoes, I used um, a quart of heavy cream and a pound of butter. So yeah, there's a lot of butter in this. Very good. This is going to be a struggle towards the end, I can tell now. <laughs> uh, I don't know why people are so concerned like how much stuff weighs. It's not really the weight of the food. It's the volume and things like mashed potatoes are not quite as dense as some of like rice would be very, very hard to do because it's not very dense. Pasta's not that dense either. So like that pasta video I did with like 16 pounds of pasta. It didn't feel as hard as the 16 pound of eggs, because the eggs I think were all fluffed up. Whew, it's so hot. Oh, it was chilly in here. It's cold outside, it's like 20 degrees, but. <sighs> This is a lot of potatoes.
Every time I eat mashed potatoes, I always think of that scene from the Close Encounters of the Third Kind, where the guy makes the thing out of. I don't know, this is what it reminds me of. Tastes so good. Nice and cool. Uh. A couple months, I won't have the luxury of trying to eat this slow. I'll have to try to speed up again and get ready for contests. gravy on this side. No, no, I should have mixed it in. Uh. Maybe it'll cool off faster this way. Wish it was a few degrees cooler. I think I mixed the gravy too good. Ugh. I just got a big lump of gravy. Ugh. All right, coming up on 10 minutes. I got this spoon from chili eating contest. Oh. <clears throat> no chili eating contest this year, I'm kind of glad. They are the worst contest. Nothing about them is fun. Only good thing about them is they're only six minutes. I mean, if they were any longer, people would just stop eating after like seven minutes. No one would even eat anymore. They would just sit there. 
It'd be contests who could just hold it before they throw up at that point. Tastes good. <clears throat> Pretty cheap to prepare. I have to admit, I did wimp out and used powdered potatoes. I didn't feel like peeling and mashing and all those potatoes. Who knows what difference does it make anyways? The ingredients on the box are the potatoes. It's the same thing. All right. All right. I'd call that done. Okay. Eight and a, 18 and a half pounds of mashed potatoes and gravy. I have to say that was pretty tasty. Oh. Uh-oh, I cheated. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was pretty good. The uh, gravy was really good, and except for the big lump that I forgot to mix in. And the potatoes weren't that bad. I, I wish they were... I just rubbed a bunch of potatoes in my eye. I wish the potatoes were a little bit stiffer, but I added a lot of cream, more than the direction said, because I wanted to take them, make them tasty. And they were... Oh, and I put some powdered garlic... In there as well I can, it was good all right so yeah oh stop the timer stop stop whatever it's just 13 48 it was probably around 13 when i stopped no big deal <coughs> ideally <clears throat> if i was getting ready for a contest i would try to do all that in in six minutes I, I would really try to get that done in six minutes i think that would have to be done if i want to be competitive at a chili or a mashed potato eating contest but yeah so like Subscribe again, not, not many like I think 80% of the people that watch my videos are not subscribed, so it really helped me out. Um, yeah, I kind of wish I did more, that wasn't that wasn't too bad, anyways. Still, still early, I got things to do today, I got plenty of energy. All right, thanks for watching. Oh.